freedom. And freedom. Because the, you get to pick where you get to go, and then you get to go be with yourself and be happy about it. Yeah, well, that's, <laughs> yeah, that is that is a beautiful thing. I will say getting to, to be alone and just have the time to yourself and really just explore what's going on in your own head. You're taking an active participation it, in where you are and what you're experiencing. You're not just in an apartment. You yeah. get to go to be in a campground. Or... Yeah, and for some people, you know, you can, some people can meditate in an apartment and look at a wall, and they can take themselves places and be at peace. For me, it's easier. I will say some people need to take certain drugs, DMT or something, you know, but, you know. You I can, like that one. Yeah. <laughs> That's <laughs> another, another, another interview that I'll do sometime. That's a good but, one. But, um, yeah, you know, I, I will say presence and then also battling those those fears. and ten So, like, you know, if you're in a conversation like right now, you might be thinking there's a thought in your head that you want to say, but something's telling you, oh, it might be off topic or, oh, it's this. But I found out the more you push yourself to go that path, the more the reward comes at the end. So, so here is fear in front of us, mm -hmm. and we have to cross fear to get to the reward, whether it's anything in life, I think music or work or anything, because you, you find that that's what's holding us all back, is fear from whatever it may be. But there's that fear that everybody has, and even when you, you know, for me, when I play music, you know, you start out and you get uncomfortable or something happens, but you got to push through and keep going on where you know you're headed because only you actually know in your heart where you're going. You just have to follow it because no one else is going to tell you to go there and they're going to see the obstacles, but they'll see the, the, the end result if you push through and go for it. Um, so I will say fear is a big thing. You uh, also presence, believe in gonorrhea. Gonorrhea. <laughs> in fact, you open, you open with gonorrhea. Yeah, so yeah, this whole yeah. thing you're talking about fear, I'm like, does he have a fear of gonorrhea? Because you know, we're, we're just in this weird loop of the fear. Yeah. Gonorrhea for sure. Yeah, All right, let yeah, me ask yeah, you one more good. question. That's I want to yeah. know about the song title, yes. Ancient History. Ancient History. So that's where I had it. this song. A lot of people described as spooky. <laughs> and I... Uh, <laughs> It makes me dance. You know. It's <laughs> <laughs> pretty fun. And we all, you know, uh, come from different backgrounds or different cultures and stuff. But what I find fascinating is the timeline of humanity to study these past civilizations that are long forgotten. And these people that, you know, we'll never know because, you know, one thing, you know, it's like with music or anybody, politics or Jesus, religious everybody's name goes by the wayside in history, right? I mean, you know, eventually, you know, some people know Mozart today, if you ask young people, but not everybody. You know, not everybody knows the Beatles, you know, a lot of young people, or not everybody knows... I've heard of them. You know, uh, <laughs> so... Make, make those, and those ancient civilizations, yeah, something Melodies like that. Or yeah, harmonics or... Yeah, I mean, uh, it's just something to remember. That's kind of where I put myself in that place when I'm playing that, that and something, because uh, cause some people describe it as spooky, that and with like ghosts, that's kind of where I was talking about ghosts, goblins, and gonorrhea. Ancient ghosts. <laughs> gonorrhea, ancient ladies God. and gentlemen. That's been around for thousands of years. Thousands of years. not going anywhere. Thousands no. of years. Currently, <laughs> none of us are aware if we have it or not, but no, the cool no, thing is, is we might. Well, I've been tested, and I'm I'm feeling good. thousands of years of gonorrhea. To any female fans, I don't have it. No, <laughs> but not. Um, well, anyways, uh, I want to thank you for being here. Appreciate it. Now, Jackson, yeah, I want to thank you for putting this together, getting creative souls and minds together to do the magic, because that's what it is, kind of, is magic, yeah. you know, when yeah. people get together and do this. Casting spells. Yeah. So uh, uh, thanks to uh, every for you to you Appreciate for being it. here. Yeah, thank you, sir. Where, yeah. where, where can we find your music? Um, so if you go on Gunner with an A, G U N N A R, uh, Gunner's Music and Travels. I go on all the social media, TikTok, Instagram, uh, Gunner's Music and Travels, TikTok, Instagram, cool. uh, Facebook. Um, just look me up on that, and uh, we'll we'll get together. You know. I still want to talk more about the travels. The travels, I do got, yeah, we can keep going on that for, for a yeah, while. Want to give us one little travel story? I just want to want to yeah. know a little more about this taste of freedom that you're having that I'm so desirous of. And and maybe how it came about or what, you, you seem to be like, like okay, it's yeah. like not a big deal, but it seems like a big deal. I guess, uh... Because you called it gu travels as well. I mean, travels, travels, yeah. I guess ever since I was young, I had a yearn for it, you know. So I just, I, I just. Is there to a say, goal for a destination, or you just like being on? I think it's like, like the cliche. It's just the journey, you know. Right. It's a cliche, Rad. but. Rad. Yeah. yeah. It yeah. takes a brave person to actually continue to do that. There's a, he a hell of a lot of bravery to do that. Yeah. Thanks. Yeah. Yeah. I've had some, uh, not too many uncomfortable situations, but yeah, you do. You get in situations where you have to, you know, just anything. Like I said, that fear, but you have to push through it 
And, you know, of course, life's not always going to be peaches and roses, but there, you know, we just have to keep pushing to what we want. I have a lot of admiration. I have a big van that would be perfect to do what you're talking about. Yeah. But there's yeah. an element of me that's yeah. just still way too chicken shit to, like, keep pushing the boundaries of how far I can drive that van in a one-way. It's, it's a well, scary idea. Like, you can, you, what you know, I really want to do. You know, if you're working, you can always, you know, if you got money saved, if your car breaks down, you, you know, you take care of that, you know, the physical side of life, you know, the monetary stuff, but, you know, you got to pay for some of the tow. You've got this thing dialed in. The solar is nice. Yeah, if only. That's how you got to do it. I'd have a solar van for sure. Yeah, if you you could have an electric car that drove lots of them. Right now, I think Elon's got to work, you know, get those cars to go pretty far. You know, they're getting there, you know, but, but yeah, I mean, if we can just live off the sun, I mean, like the plants with the chlorophyll, you know, you're sunbathing out of the ocean and something like that, you know, then we're getting one step closer, I think. Nice, yeah. nice. Let's close with the chlorophyll. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I'm going the little right. I like it's it. freezing in here. Gunner Linden. Thank you, Gunner. Thank you. Thank you. I love the umbrella. It felt cozy. <laughs> Made me feel...